Yo, what's up internet? So I want to take you behind the scenes of repairing one of the murals that recently got hit up. And you know, when you're doing work in the public or the streets, you really have to expect that if it can be touched or sprayed on, it will be. So you have to really account for, you know, maintaining the mural that you're doing or whatever public art that you're doing. Um, so that's a lot of work and that's half the battle of keeping it up there. So the more uh, public work you have, the more maintenance you have to sort of worry about. But this one was coated with the Sherwin-Williams uh, coating and I did a video on that. I'll have that one uh, in the description and a link to that one in the video. And that coating is really great because it's silicone based so it's like a thick coating and it allows you to easily pressure wash anything that's on top of it away but I didn't have a pressure washer or access to a water tap so I just had to break out my paint sprayer and just use water which is a fraction of the pressure that you really need to wash things away so I used the Heritage Graffiti Removal so Solution from uh, the World Best Graffiti uh, Company and I have a video on that as well but that just helps sort of break up the thickest parts because like I said the spray does not get enough pressure to actually just wash it away without the solvent so I had to actually turn around the tip on the end of the gun uh, to actually get a little bit more pressure and that really helped out if I got really close and chipped away at it so it took a lot longer than you know it would have if I had a pressure washer but overall basically I'm happy that I coated it um, because if I did not coat it I would have to redo a lot of those different areas and this is basically an hour hour and a half out of my day you know it's annoying but it's way better than having to color match and redo a lot of those different areas especially you know if I haven't touched the wall in a long time uh, the only thing about the coating that I used on this one because it's silicone based it does attract a lot of dust so you can kind of see the dusty areas versus the areas that I just sort of threw water on with the solvent and sort of tried to pressure wash as much as I can with the sprayer so those areas are a lot clearer because I not only got rid of the spray paint on top of it but also the dust so I actually have to go back and sort of do some of the other parts of the mural that's really dusty because up close you can really see the difference not far away and most people see it far away but you know i'm a stickler for detail so i want to actually get all that dust uh, off as well to make sure it's evenly coated so i'm gonna actually invest in a self-enclosed pressure washer um, that i can use all the time um, so if something does happen i can easily um, pressure wash my Self without having to have a tap but this is the results it definitely you can see the clean areas that had basically all black paint on it but you can also see the dust as well um, from top to bottom like I said I'm gonna go back and do that but hopefully this helped out and I'll see you next time peace